Hi, this is Marco from eeprogrammer.com. Uh, I'm going to talk about how to um, do some simple filtering, uh, some simple uh, signal processing stuff in MATLAB. So, um, if you have a signal, let's say we have uh, we do some data recording and then we have some signal. Um, this is our output. Uh, at a thousand hertz, so you can see there is a like forty-five thousand data point represent for around like forty-five seconds. If we zoom in to the picture, we can see we can see the general shape of the signal, but you can also see there are many lights in the signal. So how can we handle this lights? What we can do is we can do some filtering. Uh, in MATLAB, but how can we do filtering? Uh, since we can, from the graph, we know we should use a no-pass filter. So we want to design a no-pass filter. One of the key command to design a no-pass filter is butter. So we type how butter. What it is here is talking about a Butterworth digital and analog filter. So um, if you read into detail, basically you can see you can uh, design a high pass, no pass, and a band stop filter. This time we want a filter. Let's say if we want to create a filter at cut off frequency five hertz with um, second order. So n is second order. W n is a number in between 0 and 1 and 1 is corresponding to half of the sample weight. That is important. It's not full of the sample weight. So what it is talking about is if I want to the cutoff frequency at 5 hertz um, which is talking about half of the cutoff frequency of the full cutoff frequency to be like 500 hertz so we need to have like 5 divided by 500 so in WN, we want to be point O one. Assume we want a second order of butter, uh, butterworth filter. That is the way we create the filter. It come up with some warning. The reason is, we uh, MATLAB is case sensitive. But in this case, MATLAB know we are going to use the butter function. So it just come up with the warning and it's still natural to create the butter butterworth filter, which is BNA. Okay, so we create BNA, we create a filter. How can we use this butterworth filter? First of all, um, I also want to talk about what is um, cut off frequency. Cut off frequency is the frequency at which the power of the loss drop for fifty percent. So uh, that's why people uh, always talk about like minus three dB. That is a um, minus three dB, dB cut off frequency. Is talking about like at that specific point, the loss is cut off by fifty percent. Okay, so we use the CLC command to clean up the command screen, and then now how can we use apply the previous filter? We can use an other term called filter. Let let's see what is filter. So in filter, uh, it is very simple. So basically, is you have your data which is called x, that is like the data with loss, and you have your filter which is like DNA value you generate just now uh, using the butter uh, command, and then y would be your output. So we can make a part on the original data and we want it to be a support to one month okay and then we can make another support for the new data which we have not created yet by using the command we know the command should be filter B A N data. So 
Let me do this. We can see the port in here. So we can see the signal is much more clear now. So assume I zoom in from this 1000 to 1500 data point here. It's just very noisy and compared to this 1000 to 1500 data point in here. And it's just much more clear. So that is how do we do the noise cancellation in MATLAB.